Okay, this is going to be a proper review on the gaffs that I had purchased on Janet's closet. Um, I barely got them in the mail yesterday. And um, this is the kind of packaging it comes in. So, yeah, and let me open it. This is what, how it was packaged like this. It was in there like that. So, the receipt and everything. <laughs> I just looked at it right there and she just says, thank you. But, yeah. I ordered the white and the pink and on their web is saying Janet's gaffs then it says the color but right here on the tag if you can see that it says um Amy's gaffs like yeah Amy half so that's why I thought was different and I did open it and check them out, but I haven't worn them yet, so I can't say how they wear, but they're slightly different than the gaffs I had purchased before on another site. Um, here it's in this one, and I can explain. Um, here's this one. It's what a, the white one looks like. The front the back and, and it, as the tag says extra small um because my waist is 27 and all the gaps is really hard to find anything smaller than my size so I have to get that and what most people don't do when they re I've noticed on reviews they don't this on the back has the back part from here down to here is a single uh, yeah from here to here is a single layer from here to here this is where the part tucks is this part and what's different with this one compared to the other one the other ones i had purchased before the other ones I've purchased before, yes, there's a three layer and the inner panel came up to here on the other ones, but this one, the inner panel comes down to here. like, yeah, it's from here to here is the inner panel, that third panel, it's right here, and the gaps like before were at the top, but once you put it on, it stretched out to down here. So it's stretched out from putting it on down to where this one is. So this one's already in that same place, just it's not um, done by stretching it out. It's already there. So that's what was different with this one. And the pink one, I've noticed. Um, let's open this. Um, and the pink one, all the gaps are saying redesigned. So if you look on the website and it says redesigned, it's talking about this is the um, yeah front panel, and this looked like on camera it looks a lot lighter than what it is. It's more hot pink than on camera, but still cute. This is the back, and the panel, front panel on this one, um, find there it is, right, yeah, here, so it's from here to here, so, yeah, and this one is a lot smaller, like, I could say low-waisted, and this one's high-waisted. So if I put them next to each other, you can actually see the 
pink one's a lower waisted, like low waisted, and the other one's high waisted. You can see that. That's the difference when they say reconstructed. So that's the difference. This has a um, single layer back panel and a three layer front panel. It's just on this one, that panel is from here yeah, to here, from here to here. And higher waist one is from here to here. You can see that difference. Yeah, from here. And that's the area right there. And the gaff um, that most crucial part for tucking from here to here. So yeah and on their website they have other colors um black red and they also have a nude and the white and pink like what i showed so that's the um gaps on janet's closet and the construction also the waistband you can see how this is much smaller and elastic is stretchy and how this one there's more so that stretchiness see so yeah and since um, I've done so much research on gaps now. Ones that more like this one tucks better, like the lower waisted ones, ends up tucking better. So, but when I ordered them, I didn't know they're were both going to be different like that. But they are what they are, and that's what I was able to find for a reasonable price um, on sale for $16.95 um, compared to other sites where they were around 17 up to depending on what you got around 21 22 some of them were like $30 all the way up to a hundred and something depending on if you got the specialty kind but these ones were a reasonable price so I ordered them and yeah for the price it was it's worth it so if you're wondering um, about these ones from that website that's what they look like. The pink one, low waisted. And this white one is high waisted. So if you can't actually get into their store, you can um, still buy online. So that's what I did. And I can say the customer review or customer help and everything I emailed her about because it doesn't specifically say on the website that there are three layer front panel and it's the three layer front panels the kind you want because that tucks the ones the gaps that have more panels in the crotch area so I emailed her then like the next day I got a message back and yeah and she was very helpful and seems really supportive of the LGBT community so I would recommend her website 
And yeah, that's the gals from Janet's Closet. The pink. That looks lighter on camera, which is it's actually a hot pink. Not a baby pink, because that's what it looks like on camera, but it's actually a the light one. Which it's a little bit darker and the material's kind of shine. So it's got a little bit of shine to it. But you can't really tell on camera. Um but after you wash it, um, it's like the last gaffs I got that had that shininess like that. After you use it and wash it a few, that shininess does tend to go away. So, just be aware of that. And that's my review on the Janet's gaffs without having them try it on can't say how they fit so um, I'm going to do a separate video on that so look out for that video so yeah